Hey there people and welcome once again in the farming simulator. So yeah, this is the map Alma, Missouri. Hopefully it's pronounced Alma. This is the starting farm. This is decoration. What? <laughs> Alright. So that is the house, typical American style house with the AC and whatnot. American flag, of course. <laughs> Wait a minute, can I play basketball? I, don't, I can't even tell if you wait for the. Because. Yeah, it's so static. Oh yeah, it's probably went for it. To be honest, so... Yeah. Got quite a few stuff on the farm. I played with off screen and I think the tractor needs upgrades that do not have like the marks horsepower they can have. Yeah. yeah. I had the maximum in the last LP but whatever. I probably won't use it for long to be honest. We'll see. Should I even upgrade? Yeah, whatever. Some weights and we will see weights. Oh, that is the old Chundi tracker. You can't upgrade this, right? This is like 190 horsepower, and that's about it. Yeah, typical red barns. It is the cow place, look, definitely looks like it. Uh, but, but at the beginning, when I spawned first time, uh, I was in the over here. Oh, yeah, the engine. farm is over here so yeah horses sheep cows deck when you start with is actually pretty decent for start that's either I have the drilling function and it's six meters plant is nine meters so yeah with these movers, when you combine them, you will get 7.5 meters, not bad. Tethers, good. 8.7, wind rover, 8.4, yeah. And this baler. I don't think I ever so use this one. So, might as well use it. At least for a while. Yeah. 
Yeah, we got the headers, this trailer. I don't think I ever used this one. I still don't remember. Actually, the header. Maybe I upgrade it to pay more. Yeah, it can. Okay. And the uh, combine, yeah, we use in a lot of the New Holland as well, but yeah, this is a different one. Uh, New Holland having case as well. But yeah, that's a different one. I don't have to seem, have, seem to have any weights right now. Which is interesting. Okay, so there are new crops over here. Alfalfa, peas and rye. I know if you can do something with peas in the factories. Rare is your typical weed like crop. Oh, so also this is all grass over there. Interesting. And alfalfa is the crop that I really wanted to have in the game for a long time as well. So, yeah. Oh, you can even buy those. I thought those are like at the edges and you can buy the gun. You got Soul Meal. And here you got BGA. The BGA is actually quite small. And it doesn't even have the silo nearby. Well, so far we can make around bills. So as you can see, we got like a lot of grass around here as well. This is a big map after all.
No, yeah. He's not perfect, of course. All right, all right. Just checking something real quick. Putting this in. Cool. All right. <laughs> there we go, <laughs> wonderful. I like the sounds, by the way, of nature. It's lovely. Holy crap. Up a little much.
All right, so let's save it. And I remember reading something about a new like crop circle and whatnot. Oh, there is actually spring wheat now. Interesting. No spring barley too. Mm. May and June for soybeans, yeah, that definitely change. So peace. Layer rye is only winter crop. All right, we might get rye. Return. Peace only April. It's interesting because peace over here are only seated in March. Alpha, 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 alpha here also. Only in March. Of course, you can see it for the whole year, yeah. Well, not the whole year, but it wouldn't make sense otherwise. Also, it seems like the new crops were implemented as well. Well, implemented well. They are pretty much the same as they were before. All right. And harvest time October, November, yeah. So yeah, we might get some sugar cane, we might get some cotton in this OP. Haven't anything with sugar cane in ages and with cotton last time. I think it was the previous DLC map. Uh, Silver and forest, yeah. I think it was good, right? So what animals we are getting? Definitely cows. They are pretty much pushing heavy, and yeah, we have alpha, alpha. And I'm definitely used to alpha, alpha over here, where I live. Half of us is really common. But basically, actually, everything is the same as grass, just it's grows on fields. So, hopefully, it will be the same in the game as well. Yeah, as you can see, just this field alone is pretty big. Compared to like the long camel not. There's not that many fields here, but they're all quite big. I mean, we are in America. <laughs> is Missouri like one of the poorest states in the US or is it Mississippi? I think one of those two is like the po considered the poorest or is the poorest. I know which one, I always get those two confused, even though they are not even neighbors, I think. There's like one or two states between them.
Okay, so this is so fun. Let me start over here. And just go there like this. Yeah, we are actually going to it. It's kind of funny. You know, though it doesn't look like, but you can see it on me. Yeah, so he got 190, as I say, right? So. And those 80 plus 70, so 150. You can also, I should probably also uh, show you the city or town. Uh, we can have drive through the map. I mean, so me or nothing really special about it. Wonder if there are like other farms to buy. Obviously you can buy those as well, which is interesting. And yeah, the fields, as you can see, are pretty high prices. What I like about the fields, none of them are... Well, these have pretty good shape, but none of them are like those super square shapes, you know. I mean, they're excellent for AI, but for gameplay purposes they get pretty boring. At least for me. Definitely when I was younger and the old farm simulator games, I used to love those type of fields. But nowadays, yeah. When I'm working on them, I prefer when they have like weird shapes. Because it's much more fun to work on them. Definitely. Okay, so we are entering the town. Like the cool de sacs are pretty common around here. Yeah, dead end. I wonder if the cool de sac is like French words because definitely sounds French. Yeah, it looks pretty nice. Nice small town. People are working, working what? <laughs> it's so common in the US. Everybody rides cars, right? <laughs> okay. Let's catch a factory. It's one of the new factories over here. How much do we have to pay for it? It's pretty big. Only 40k. And there is a lot, of, a lot more products and like new factors and whatnot on this map. Oh, I see this land. It's kind of fun they give us gator. Instead, I know, we'll like pick up. Oh, that's fine. So we can explore a little bit. Okay, so this is Hunter Factory actually, yeah. <coughs> Sorry about it. Kids are being bad. <laughs> 
So what is this? Methane is filling station. Oh yeah, the bug is not produced methane. And you can sell it here. Bell cell point. Here's where the train is going through. Here there is train. Back of there, seven over there. Under one of the new factories, right? Oh, yeah, I guess it's in the front. Is this for a bakery or for what? No, it's dairy. Interesting. Of parallel park cars. Here we got a bakery. Factory seems to be pretty cheap. So we got pizza. Oh, there are actually people here. I can't go inside. This is tailor shop. The well, corn dryer is a new thing. We also got a grain mill over here. Actually, it's free. Okay, the priciest thing ever <laughs> on this map. Yeah, to be honest, I don't know how this will work. Uh, there's a methane, so it will be in the, of course, liquid form. Makes sense. Do we have like some sort of tanker or what can take methane? Definitely a lot of you guys misc. Okay, those can take me in. Yeah. LPG, okay. You will use the thing mode. Holy crap, why the heck is that 8 down? Whoa, the white tape make it so unrealistic. I don't like that. Uh, whatever.
I wanted to use that mod, it was fine mod, but yeah, that make it very unrealistic. But of course, I can make it whatever I want. Anyway, I'll be back.